Hey everyone! Uh, so today I'm going to share with you guys a recipe that I have for a cough suppressant um, that I've used with my family, with my kids. I hate waking up in the middle of the night when they're coughing and they're miserable and they can't sleep and I can't sleep. Uh, and this is something that I've learned over the years doing a lot of research um, about different uh, items like the things I'm going to show you today that help alleviate the cough. It's not a cure for anything. It's not a cure for the common cold. It's not a cure for the flu. Uh, but it does keep you hydrated. The kids like it because it tastes good and it does help alleviate the cough a little bit so that they can sleep. So I'm going to share that with you today. So you need two basic ingredients and then a third optional ingredient. So the first ingredient you're going to need is apple juice and you're going to want 100% apple juice. You don't want something that is like a cocktail with sugar added to it. You want just the apple juice. And what apple juice does is it cuts the phlegm in the throat. And so it makes it easier to breathe. So you're going to want apple juice, and I'll show you if I can get the lid off. In a mug, you're going to put it in a mug. And so just pour a whole cup of apple juice. And then you're going to want a cinnamon stick and you want the stick you do not want uh, ground cinnamon because the ground cinnamon instead of going into the liquid and permeating the liquid it just sits on the top of the liquid I've actually tried it with the ground cinnamon and it does not work so you need to use a cinnamon stick and cinnamon is a natural cough suppressant and so the cinnamon in the cinnamon stick is going to help with the cough and this obviously is you know, too tall for my mug, and so I just break it in half and stick it down in the apple juice. And this can be where you stop. For my kids, this was where I stopped because they did not like the next ingredient. And this will, or it always helps my kids. Uh, it's not a cure-all, like I said, but for some kids, it works great. For me, it works great. I've used it multiple times throughout the years when I've had a cough. My husband likes it. He enjoys using it as well. Um, and then the last thing, like I said, I don't put in my children's because they don't like it. My husband actually does not like it very much either, is ginger. And ginger is an antiviral. It doesn't actually help with the cough, but I guess for me, I feel like it's a natural immune, bo immune booster. And so I add that to mine and I just peel it, cut off a piece, usually just you know half an inch long, and I smash it and put it in the mug so that it can uh, steep with the cinnamon stick. So I take this and I'm gonna put it in the microwave for at least a couple of minutes. You don't necessarily want it to be boiling, but you want it to be hotter than you can drink because we're gonna let it sit then for a few minutes. So I'm gonna put this in the microwave and I'll be back. Okay, so this has been in the microwave. I didn't warm it up as hot as I usually do, but it's been in the microwave. And now what you wanna do is you want to take a plate. I usually take a plate anyway and cover it and let it sit. And you're going to let it sit until it cools off to a temperature that you can drink it, obviously. <laughs> um, for kids, obviously lukewarm is probably the best. For adults, I mean, we like ours a little bit warmer, but you don't want it super hot. And you're just going to let it steep. And as it steeps, it's going to permeate, the cinnamon is going to permeate the liquid as well as the ginger, ginger if you put the ginger in there. And that's the purpose of the cinnamon stick. Anyway, um, I give my kids this during the day when they're coughing. I let them drink some during you know, the evening, right before they go to bed. And I will even take the mug and set it on the nightstand so if they wake up in the middle of the night. One thing I do tell them is, you know, don't guzzle it, just sip it. You're going to want to have a little bit of, um, you don't want to be up going to the bathroom all night long either because then you start coughing again. But you want some there just in case they wake up in the middle of the night and need it. Uh, one thing to note, the cinnamon sticks, you don't have to use a new cinnamon stick every single time. The one that's in here, I could use um, six or eight times before it starts to reduce the amount of, I guess, cinnamon that it exudes into the drink, into the liquid. So keep your cinnamon stick, save that, it'll be fine. And um, this is a great way to keep cups down in your house. The other thing I do, you don't have to heat it up. If you know that there's going to be somebody with a cold in your home, you know, if it's cold and flu season, whatever, you can take like a water bottle and fill it up 
with the apple juice, and then I would use a whole cinnamon stick, and then again, if ginger, if you're gonna put that in there, and just put it in my refrigerator for about 24 to 36 hours, and it also permeates into the liquid, and it works just fine cold, it works fine hot, either way. My kids like it warm, it's kind of comforting, you know, right before they go to bed. So that is the recipe. Um, if you like this recipe, I would love it if you would like and subscribe my page. And if you're looking for the recipe in written form, you can find it on my website, stephanieritchieart.com. And it's in my blog and it's under um, cough. The blog post is called cough and it's April 2022. So if you're looking at this six months from now when your kids are coughing and can't find the recipe, or want to print it out, it's a good thing to just have on hand and to remember. So you can get on there, um, the archives, April 2022, um, under top, and you will find the recipe written down, and then you can print it out. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this uh, little short little tutorial, and I hope you try this at home. Like I said, it's, it may not work for everyone, but it works for me and my family, and I hope that it'll help you guys as well. Thanks.